Hi, here in the Mesa office today, alone, doing some virtual meetings. And we were asked by one of our media outlets that we provide some articles for. They asked if we have relevant information for, um, for coronavirus, for what's happening right now. So first thing I would say is, um, you know, it is highlighting estate planning. It's gotten people thinking about it. Um, I don't want to emphasize the fear and all of that, but if people are thinking about their estate plans, I do want to help them get it done. So number one, if you don't have a plan, uh, write something out by hand is the quickest and easiest way to get started, especially if you're um, your partner, you're not legally married, or if your beneficiaries are not your legal blood related. Uh, situation. Um, very common issue I see when someone passes away, um, say a couple that um, I had recently, um, her husband passed away, um, the house was in his name, he had kids from a prior relationship who will now receive half of that house. So uh, write out your wishes um, by paper just to put something in play. If you want to get a more comprehensive plan, we can work virtually. Now, um, technology, more people are doing the video meetings now. This is, this events or these events have highlighted that. People are, are getting on Zoom calls and FaceTiming more. And we can also do business that way. So we do have the tools where um, that initial video meeting, I think is just as effective, if not more effective. 